While Aussies have always complained about the Kiwi invasion, they're getting their own back with one of their most deadly spiders. New research shows that redback spiders are not only here in greater numbers, but they could also breed in new areas of New Zealand. Tom McRae with the details. Small, docile, but deadly. It's excruciatingly painful venom. The pain from a redback bite has been described as being like having your skin ripped off. One of Australia's most venomous spiders, they've been here for decades. But new research is showing there's more of them, and they're being found in more places. They like it hot and dry. They need a, a long period of, of um, warm weather to mature their eggs. The research shows areas where colonies are likely to be found include urban Auckland, Tauranga, Gisborne, Hawke's Bay and central Otago. They like rocky outcrops, vineyards, grasslands and dry areas under houses. And with the higher numbers, the risk is growing in populated areas. It would be regarded as a potential problem from a human health perspective. And they're also a threat to our native animal and insect species. There could be a problem in central Otago where they're feeding on endangered beetles, um, possibly even skinks. The spiders hitch across the Tasman in shipping containers. So we've got a great deal of awareness of the border about where they might be and how they might get in, but of course it's difficult to get every single one. But the news isn't all bad. No one has been killed in over 50 years by a redback in Australia since anti-venom has been available. But the female will stay in her web for her entire life. Um, you really have to work hard to try and sort of come in contact with these things. If you do see one, get in contact with MAF. Tom McRae, One News.